Hi, Megan from Shaler Honda here. I'm one of the sales consultants. I'm here to show you how to use your lane keep assist and your adaptive cruise control on your 23 Honda CRV. To engage your lane keep assist, you're going to press this button right here, steering wheel with the dashed lines. That will turn it on. And what it does is it attempts to keep you centered in the lane that you are driving in, whether you're on the highway or on a normal road. It will sense the lanes. It will sense the lanes curving on the road and will attempt to steer for you as well. So the green light is engaged, which means it is detecting the lines. And I could take my hand off the steering wheel and it's going to steer for me. It likes you to keep your hands on the wheel and will let you know if your hands are not on the wheel, not moving, but it's keeping me perfectly centered in the lane, but steering required. And curve, and I'm not touching it. But it stopped detecting the line, so it was turned up white to let me know that's not detecting the lines and that I needed to input steering. And you can easily turn this feature off by pressing that steering wheel with the dash line button again. And then it is off for the time being. So I'm going to turn on my lane keep assist just because it's nice to coincide with the adaptive cruise control. And then to turn on the adaptive cruise control, you're going to hit the car button with the little speedometer and the arrow, turn it on. Get up to the speed that you want, downshift this to set it, and what it's doing right now is detecting the car in front of me, and it's going to pace me to that car, but keep a certain following distance. You can specify your following distance with this button right down here, but you can also adjust the speed with this plus and minus. As of right now, it's detecting the car in front of me, and it's going to keep a certain following distance. If the car was to go be going slower than I am, car will slow itself down. Now, I don't have to be touching the gas. I don't have to touch the brake. It'll do it all by itself. And I also have the lane keep assist going, so it will attempt to steer as well. So you're having a nice relaxing drive on the highway, especially if you're going for long trips. It's very nice, very effective. So this car has come in front of me. The car is now slowing itself down. And if you would like to turn it off, all you have to do is press this button right here and you can turn it off for you and then you're back to your normal drive.